The Butuan Ivory Seal or Bis, Filipino, Garing Pantotic ng Butuan, Cebuano, Garing Patak sa Butuan, is an ivory stamp or seal stamp or a privy seal associated with a rhinoceros ivory tusk, dated 9th 12th century, was found in Libertad, Butuan in Agusan del Norte in southern Philippines. Inscribed on the seal is the word Butban in stylized Kawi. The script has a similarity to the Tagalog script. Butban, was presumed to stand for Butuan or Butuan, since the letters B, and W, were frequently interchanged. The discovery of the seal proved the theory that pre-colonial Filipinos, or at least in coastal areas, used seals on paper. Before the discovery of the seal, it was only thought that ancient Filipinos used bamboo, metal, bark, and leaves for writing. The presence of paper documents in the classical era of the Philippines is also backed by a research of Otley Bayer stating that Spanish friars boasted about burning ancient Philippine documents with Suyat inscriptions, one of the reasons why ancient documents from the Philippines are almost non-existent in present time. The ivory seal is now housed at the National Museum of the Philippines. Discovery Another archaeological piece with ancient inscription, the Butuan Ivory Seal was recovered in the 1970s by pot hunters in a prehistoric shell midden site in Ambangan, Libertad, Butuan City in Agusan del Norte. Made of rhinoceros ivory tusk, the object could have been used to stamp documents or goods during trading. The ivory seal as well as other archaeological materials recovered in Ambangan archaeological sites are proof that Rajanate of Butuan was an important trading center whose official seal marked the source of commodities it produced and exported. Dating Dated 1002 AD, the seal could have been used for documentation in trading. Butuan was the center of trade and commerce in northeastern Mindanao since 10th century. There were other notable discoveries like the ivory seal and the silver paleograph. Gold and tools for gold processing of ornaments have also been recovered from a village site. Over a hundred clay crucibles and tools for the processing of gold items were discovered in the area, leading to the conclusion that an extensive gold ornaments industry was located in these areas as far back as a thousand years ago. Go. Altogether, these data demonstrate that Butuan was a thriving international trading port a thousand years ago. This site has a tremendous historical impact in the Asian region. See also Kawi Baybayan Rajanate of Butuan Hainanoo script Tagbanwa alphabet Buid script Filipino orthography Vatilutu Privy seal References